I'm John Kuypers and my business is Wicked Sharp Shears. I love my job. I love what I do. I get up in the morning and I like going to work. I spend my days doing what I love to do, sharpening, and I spend my days in hair salons with fun, creative people, and it's a great way to make a living. The other thing that I really like to do with my business is to teach, to share my experience and my knowledge with comprehensive, hands-on training right here in my workshop uh, to teach people how to develop their own successful business, and I can do that. I'll teach you the right way, using the proper techniques, the proper procedures, the proper equipment, and by the time you leave here, you'll know what you're doing. There's a very good chance you'll already be one of the best, if not the best, sharpeners in your market. There are other sharpeners out there. There is no shortage of them. But the major scissor companies that I work with estimate that only about 5%, that's 1 in 20, are truly competent and have enough knowledge and experience to do the job correctly. The reason that you want to be one of those 5%, you will distinguish yourself immediately in the market. There are other people calling on those salons. Many of them have consistently delivered bad, substandard work. And when you show up and you can deliver consistently high quality work, you're going to be remembered and you will be invited back and you will become the sharpener of choice. And stylists will tell their friends that you know what you're doing and your business can grow. I can teach you how to do that. What we do primarily is to focus on the modern hair styling scissor. It's not like the scissors of old. It's a very specific and delicate tool and it needs to be treated accordingly. That's one of the differences that you'll get with my training. The first essential part of a good sharpening is the use of a flat honing machine. And the flat honing machine is what we use when we're creating a new edge. We do that with a various grades of abrasives. We'll start with a rougher abrasive and move through various polishing stages until it shines like a mirror, like a brand new shear. The second essential part of a traditional Japanese style sharpening is to use water stones or wet stones to finish the inside of the scissor. Many people will start a sharpening with a flat honing machine, but they will never complete it with water stones and they can never deliver the same type of results. That's a shortcut. I don't do shortcuts. If someone's interested in developing a sharpening business of their own, using the correct techniques, the correct equipment, so that when they get out there, they're going to be very well prepared, so that they can distinguish themselves from the competition right off the bat. If that person is interested in learning the right way to do it, I can help.